उत्तर प्रदेश आर नेक्स्ट स्टोरी कम्स इन टू यू फ्रॉम द हाई कोर्ट एंड द सुप्रीम कोर्ट अमिट्स द ऑन गोइंग टसल दैट वी टॉक टू यू अबाउट बिटवीन द सुप्रीम कोर्ट एंड द सेंटर ओवर जुडिशियल अपॉइंटमेंट्स द सुप्रीम कोर्ट इज सेट टू गेट अ न्यू जज former bombay high court chief justice dipankar datta is going to be sworn in as the supreme court judge the center has notified his appointment all of that is set to take place today let's bring you more in terms of context in this entire story my colleague ananya is also with us uh, to bring us more context on this entire story ananya i believe dipankar datta had to actually wait for more than 2 and a half months before being able to take up this post Uh, but there is also the context of the ongoing tussle between the center and the supreme court why are we setting this story within that context ananya bring our audiences more information please yeah you know i remember that this is the first appointment to the supreme court amidst the court the tussle that is going on between the center and the state government uh the former chief justice of bombay high court mr dipankar datta who was until now the chief justice of bombay high court will now be sworn in today at sanjay sri as the judge of the supreme court of india after uh, him taking over as the supreme court judge the sanjay sri of the supreme court would uh, actually come come to 28 uh, uh, while the sanjay sri remains to be 34 so now the supreme court would be having after datta's appointment would be having 28 judges the center yesterday shared his appointment remember that she is a uh, uh, joint the bar in the uh, uh, bar in 1989 uh is born in february 9 uh, and uh, has also uh, has practiced for judicial and civil matters before the bombay high court the calcutta high court and the supreme court as well so somebody who who has been in the profession for a decade now uh, is going to be taking over as a judge of the supreme court a very very competent judge when it comes to the bombay high court has given out various judgments and now uh, we have to wait and see as to how his term goes before the supreme court does uh, because uh, he would be having a uh, pretty a uh, pretty longer tenure at the supreme court because he's still young and uh, we might think that uh, it's, it's a longer tenure for him yeah and the top post going to be cut but definitely this this comes at the time when there is already a tussle going on between the supreme court and the center over judicial appointment while the central government uh, including the law minister and the vice president are constantly saying that the ngc was a better system of appointments while uh, the uh, the legal fraternity is defending the collegiate system saying that it's the law of the land and those minor tweaks are uh, needed into this particular system but then this is the final system of appointments that is there for uh, in fact the judiciary in order to prevent any kind of intervention from the execution at this point the times from there or the other this comes as a very very important okay. uh, appointment that is coming it's the first appointment amidst this particular tussle that is going okay. on between the central and the, the supreme court and then yeah thank you for bringing us that context uh, we are going to now move on we've brought